All right, we're at it again. This, well, a few choice words for him. Found Patches two. Patches are easy, dude. Just like vine snakes? Just like vine snakes. <laughs> I had two patches last week on accident. You might not make it back down the trail. That's all I'm saying. There will be blood at the end of this video. <laughs> but that's what we're after. We're after the patches, so we'll see what happens. All right, so we've seen a few lizards, whiptails, which that's the main food source for the patch nose. Seen some side blotch lizards, which is basically food source for everything. It's a little bit before the peak hour. We're kind of looking for like kind of at five to six o'clock hour. It's about, I don't know, somewhere between 4.30 and five. So we'll see, we'll keep looking, especially in the shade like this. That's where they come in this time of day. And the passionos like to hang out kind of on the embankments right there looking in lizard holes. So we'll keep looking. I just saw orange sorted whiptail up there moving into the bushes. Seen the uh, San Diego tiger whip tail. That one's a little too big for the patch nose, but the orange throated, they'd love those. Like, I wish people could see this because he just wanted to get away. Yeah. He, do, he doesn't want to be messed with. He doesn't want to, he's not attacking us or anything. Because people are so scared. Oh, pretty yeah. much to get, you have to step on it. Yeah. Which know. does happen. I was pretty close. Snake hunter number two coming in. I found it. <laughs> he almost stepped on it. Who did? Yeah. Oh, is it a speck? It's a speck. Yeah. Wait, this is what you were trying to get? No, th this isn't the patch oh, okay. we're after, but he just keeps wanting to go away. Like, he won't settle down. Nice, dude. Where was it? Coming out? Right, of... right there. Just popping out of the bush? He was going in the bushes. Dude, nice. He want to go in my backpack. That's fine, too. That's a really pretty one. He just... I like this whole split up thing. He won't settle down, though. Like, he won't settle. All right, you're all right. Oh, Cameron, it's going to jump at no, you. They, they, they don't jump. It's not? No, okay. Oh, here's his track. Maybe. Probably when I put him down. That was him <laughs> drawing again. Okay, yeah, yeah. Here's my backpack. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Here's my backpack. I wonder if I put my backpack They don't the jump at you? That's a rumor? That's a rumor. This is a classic example of how rattlesnakes do not attack people. It never rattled and just kept trying to get away and hide in the bushes. To put it simply, it wanted nothing to do with us and wanted to go about its day. I wish more people could understand this fact about snakes. Okay, so Cameron went down like half a mile and we're basically just teaming up and covering much ground. He's got something. What do you got? What do you got? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Are you kidding me? Third one this week. Actually, he bites. I'm not gonna kiss this one. Oh, shoot, heads up. What are you doing? I'm trying to balance and not get bit by a snake. Uh, they exist. No they exist. And uh, we're gonna blur out the mountains in the background so people don't know where we find these things. We need to, yeah. yeah. need to, huh? Oh, dude. Oh, no. we, I know, we're just like, what is going on? These people are so weird. So the only reason we found this and the spec was Cameron had to bring the good luck charm. <laughs> She's full of lifers. She got her first patchy lifer the same day Ryan did. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! You know, that's real funny. We think so. <laughs> <laughs> no, dude, I'm stoked. This is so awesome. This oh, is exactly man. what we came here for. All right, so we got the coastal patch nose snake here. Not a very common species, unless your name's Cameron. Then they're common and easy to find, just like those vine snakes, right, Rob? <laughs> Seriously, this is the third one he's found this week. Um, we kind of did like a tag team effort where we hiked up to the top and then we said when we go back down he's gonna ride the bike down uh quick and then bike back up and we'll cover the ground slowly and he ended up finding it right on the trail um this one is a younger one potentially i think they grow two to three foot in length this one's i don't know 12 18 inches long probably 18 inches long 
um, but not a lot is known about them. They have a, a rostral scale, an enlarged rostral scale on their nose, which probably helps them uh, get into the dirt and into holes and stuff like that and, and look for uh, lizards, especially whiptails, but side blotch lizards, um, that's their, their main prey, um, whiptails and, and other lizards. Um, probably to hunt them and their eggs. Um, but it's a diurnal snake, comes out during the day. A lot of times will be found right around this kind of um, last light, you know, probably two hours of last light when temperatures are moderate. And a lot of times, Cameron will actually find them kind of on the side slopes uh, of the trail, um, sometimes in the shade, but uh, just looking in holes, uh, looking for lizards, looking for uh, prey. I originally thought that they were a pretty fast snake, and I think they can get pretty fast, but most of the time when, at least when Cameron has seen them, they uh, kind of stand their ground, uh, and then when he does pick them up, they do, they do bite. That's kind of their defense is they will bite. Um, he hasn't bit me. He's been very calm and chill, which is really cool. He's actually really chill right yeah, now. Yeah, very good. So we're going to let this guy go, but just super, super cool. I didn't know. I didn't think they existed. Oh, I was the of them. Um, <laughs> like, no, it's, it's still like, like feet and snakes still have tails. Like if you look close, um, it's hard to see now, but they have right down a hole. Did it really? Yeah. yeah. All right. Well, we're just getting back. So spec in the patch knows we probably would have found another snake or two if I didn't, <laughs> if I didn't spend an hour doing video and photos and stuff. So they're looking at me like, well, you guys, I'm, I'm not taking you anywhere. Yeah. Cameron's like, never again. I'm carrying this 10 pound water on my bike. Just, let's cater to Ryan. Let's cater to Ryan. Everybody. <laughs> How was that beef jerky I got you? It's really good. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, stoked that we finally got it. So awesome. So this is Cameron with his, I think he thinks it's his buddy, but I wouldn't, I will laugh actually if it bites you on the nose. I can feel his tongue. <laughs> wow. It's probably like you are one ugly thing. I know. Even the, if, if the snake thinks I'm ugly, then that's about it. 